that, in that even matter at right. this point. So you got to figure out, is it even possible that you can live? Is it possible? You, yes. You might be, you might not, you might be in the mountains in the winter with nothing around you to eat, no way for you to get off the mountain because it's too dangerous because you get cliffed out every time you try to go down and then you try to get back up and you can't get back up and you're stuck, you could fall and die. It happens to people all the time. So it's, it might not be that you can make it, but if you are gonna make it out, you're gonna wanna have some energy. And so different people have different fitness levels, obviously, so some people, like, they're not even gonna be capable of hiking out. What if you take a lunch? I mean, you don't have to eat the whole person right there. Like, you guys could. Yeah, you could, you would eat them in parts, for sure. But what would you have? It's just psychologically devastating. Uh, the, the thought of just eating human meat, it's psychologically devastating. You, you're crossing a threshold. You know, you're in. You're into. It's the dark arts. I mean, it's everything. It's everything is sad. It's, it's crazy, and it's also a rich part of uh, you know human adventure history. There's always like you run into cannibals. You know, it's like a big part of those crazy movies about oh, people yeah. visiting the jungle. They got eaten by cannibals. Even Brady Bunch. Remember, they came across some people. I think they were cannibals. One day, one day, like came a, across cannibals. <laughs> but like all, even cartoons, all of them did. It was cannibals, yeah. or like uh, Joe versus the volcano. Remember that? I don't remember that. I think he came across cannibals. Well, there was a lot of cannibals in history. A lot of cannibals. I didn't know that there was so much cannibalism amongst Native Americans. Native Americans were the cannibalized settlers. There were some of them, like.